take four. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. It's Tommy Poirot here again. Mission six. I'm going to attack Lambeth Council today. I'm outside Lambeth Town Hall. Let's start with a joke, yeah? Oh, I'm getting good at this. You know what happens if you drive a helicopter down a bus lane, yeah? Or a fast car, yeah. Or even a motorbike, or even another car. You get what's called a code 34J penalty charge notice, otherwise known as a bus lane. Right, now, let me tell you some home truths about this council. They've been issuing tickets for many, many years without the proper, proper BCA certificate from the Department of Transport. Just keep going. Fire engine. That's Mr. the bus state. They were allowed to go down bus state, by the way. And for years, they've been taking rather a lot of money. I'll give you the figures in a minute. But basically, they haven't had a proper certificate for the camera, which has satisfied the evidence at paragraph 72 of the Schedule 1 to the Act, local, London Local Authorities Act, 1996, to satisfy the criteria that the miscellaneous of evidence that I need. Yeah? They've had yeah. various cases gone against them, cuts cases, because they have got a lot, six hours, at 19 pounds an hour, lots of cases. Just my colleague, Mr. Barry Smith, has just won recently. Uh, against them, against them. And then there were costs involved in that case as well. So they, you know, it doesn't matter what the adjudicator tells them they're doing wrong, they still carry on with issue tickets. But now they've actually got another faux pas, which is that their penalty charge notices have wrongly stated the two periods in which they make use for the day are the full about 28 days. This, the penalty charge notices state this the penalty charge must be paid, that's under £20 within the period of 28 days, beginning with the date on which the penalty charge notice is served. That's rubbish. That is Codsmodel. Rubbish. Absurdity. Piffle. That makes a big crap. Similarly, it states the amount of the penalty charge is reduced by 50% to £65. You've got that right. If the penalty charge is paid no later than the last day of the period of 14 days, beginning with the date on which this notice is served. That's it. Rubbish. Crap. Councillor Claire Holland, Mr. Peter Thomas, all you people concerned with these penalty charges, you should either resign or pay everyone back. You know it's wrong because I've seen a letter with JW written on the, on the top of the headed over there, which stands for Charlie Wally, and Pete signed Peter Thomas at the bottom, which actually apologises for the error. So you should actually refund all notices and get your act together. You're not being professional. Right, so that's that, yeah. They've actually lost an application for review. They've shown total disregard for the key decision that the learning Sean Stanton Dan ruled against Ealing, again represented by Mr. Ivan Barry Smith. Uh, and they, they still carried on issuing tickets, even in one case I represented someone. They said, oh, this case is irrelevant, it's a different borough, it's a different location. This is absolutely stupid absurdity. And this is Darren Charles writing this because. The camera they used at the time said it was exactly the same as the subject of the big key case against Ely. There you go. So there you are. Unfortunately, it's too late now to apply to the auditors to complain. But if you want to contact me, I'll pet the group, my name's Scott out there, or a few other people. I'll try and get your money back, and you certainly complain to the Ombudsman. Thank you very much for listening.